everybody, it is me, Darth Owen, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to mod Star Wars Battlefront 2 for the PC. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is open up File Explorer. We're going to be finding where the game files are on your computer. So next, go to your C drive, and then Program Files times 86. So now, if you've download this, downloaded this game using a physical disk, there will be a folder called Lucasfilm. But since I downloaded it using Steam, I'll go to Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and then Star Wars Battlefront 2. And then this is what you'll find in the Lucasfilm folder if you're using a physical copy. So open up that, and for, the, for modding the game, we're going to use the Game Data folder. So next, um, well this is what it looks like if you don't have any mods. But next we're going to be opening up, or creating I guess, a new folder. We're going to name it add-on, A-D-D-O-N. So, this is where we're going to put all the mods once we've downloaded them. So, what we're going to want to do next is find an unofficial 1.3 patch. This is necessary to run um, most mods that you can find online. So, find the final file on mod DB. I'll put a link to this in the description. And just scroll down and download now. So an exe folder will show up down here, and we'll use that to use the 1.3 patch. And what that is, is pretty much an update for the game uh, made by the online community that allows mods to run in Star Wars Battlefront 2. So we'll wait for this to download. Okay, so once that's downloaded, you're going to want to find where the file is, and you can do that by clicking this and clicking show in folder on Windows. And it's in the downloads folder. So you're going to want to take the new add-on folder we just created and drag the exe file into there. Next we're going to run it and just quick skip through the installer. And there we go. Now that we have installed it, we have this right here which is the 1.3 patch. So we can delete the um, exe file so now we can actually start modding the game so go to your browser and just look up whatever mod you want to download so I'm gonna look up um, Star Wars Battlefront 2 the Force Awakens mod and what this does is pretty much add um, uh, the, the, the Force Awakens to Star Wars Battlefront 2 so it's on mod db galactic civil war 2 and i'll um put this link in the description as well so what you're going to want to do is find the files um section and find the most recent release click it and find the download now button another ad will pop up and a zip folder will show up down here Okay, so now in our downloads, we have The Force Awakens 1.6. So you're going to want to right click it and click extract all. And you can extract it anywhere pretty much. Because I'll show you guys the actual parts we need from it. So yeah, it's extracting. And there. So now we have these fol folders right here. So really all you need is the three letter folder and just drag the three letter folder, which says TFA right here, into add-on. So we can just delete all other traces of it because we do not need it anymore. And so now that we've done that, the mod is actually already ready to run. So I'm gonna show you guys now proof that it works. Okay, so now once you've got Star Wars Battlefront 2 open, if you go to Instant Action, you will see that Galactic Civil War 2 has been added to the Eras section, along with this new map being added. So, here's some proof that it actually works, also showing you guys some gameplay of it. So we're just going to do it on Endor, Conquest. Okay, so now that we have the game open, as you can see, the... um two factions are the resistance and the first order and all of these new characters have been 
added. So, um, also another thing you'll notice is that the blaster bolts look much more like they do in the actual new movie. So, uh, yeah. If you guys like this tutorial, please be sure to like, subscribe, and comment. If you still have any questions, also leave those in the comments because I will be sure to answer them.